Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today's video is a very important one because I'm going to be rebonding Lola with Buttercup and Noelle. For those of you who may not have known, Lola unfortunately did get a contagious fungus that is contagious to guinea pigs and humans. So I did have to separate her from my other girls, which was very hard for me. Today, I'm going to be trying to rebond her with them. I really hope this bonding works and I really hope that they can just get back together because I really miss seeing all my girls together. I'm gonna go ahead and set up the pen now and just get them ready for bonding. This is the bonding area. It is a five by six, which is 30 square feet, 10 square feet for each pig. And I just put a big pile of hay and I have a little towel here in case for some reason they need to be separated. So I actually think I'm gonna go ahead and put Lola in first because she's the dominant pig. And now I'm gonna put in Buttercup in a well. And we're going to see how that works out. I really hope it works. We're going to go ahead and put the girls in. As you can see, I did go ahead and put the girls in and I'm just going to go ahead and speed up the clips because you guys do not need to see three hours of bonding without being sped up. That would be very long. So the girls did very well. They just had a lot of normal behaviors. Lola just chased them and she would rumble strut and hump them. And the other guinea pigs were pretty submissive. They were really good. Noelle a couple times did bother Lola. Noelle did have a hard time submitting to Lola, but it did end up working out and I'm so happy. As you can see, there are just a bunch of clips of them following each other and trying to work things out. When bonding guinea pigs, I definitely recommend putting a big pile of hay or food in the middle of the bonding area to help just distract them so that they will not be chasing each other and they actually have something to do together. I did go ahead and give each of the girls a carrot just to hopefully get them used to eating with each other again. And they did do very well and they ended up just chilling. After eight hours of bonding and being in the pen, I then cleaned out the whole enclosure and took down the wall just to freshen things up and give them a new environment so that nobody will get territorial of their space. The last thing I'm doing is putting the girls back and then I'm just going to go ahead and clean up the pen area and they're all bonded again.
that is it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to tell us in the comments below. Thank you all so, so much for watching.